excited. Do you know how long I've waited for this soup? Oh my God. Oh my God. Guys, if you want to learn how to cook this delicious fire fillet nen, keep on watching. Hi guys, welcome back to the channel. This is the first vlog filmed in 2022 and it's gonna be a great year. I'm wishing you success, wealth, health and all of that great stuff. So guys, if you're new to this channel, you're seeing my face for the very first time, I'm Susan, this is Got Is, and on this channel, we do travel, we do lifestyle, we do vlogs, we do cooking, the whole works. Do subscribe to the channel if you like what you see and give us a big, big thumbs up. So in today's video, I'm going to be cooking a fire feather ye unnen, which translates into English as white soup with chicken. Now this is a traditional epic bibio dish, which is eaten in the south, south of Nigeria. Various other tribes have their version. I know Ibos have their version, but I'm going to be cooking the bibio version. So guys. Uh, some of you might have watched a previous video, it should appear up here or up here, I'm not sure, uh, where I told you about how I suffered to get one of the main ingredients for this dish, Uyayak. I have my Uyayak, I have all my ingredients prepared, let's start cooking. These are my ingredients for the dish. I have my chicken, which has been washed thoroughly. I've got my yam, which has been boiled and pounded. I've got my seasoning pepper, salt, stock cube, uh, blended smoked fish. You could also use crayfish. Um, I've got my yak, dried fish, onion. So I'm gonna start off steaming the fresh chicken. I'm going to add my seasoning. I'm gonna put fresh pepper inside. I'm going to add my seasoning cubes. smoked dry fish but as I said before you can use crayfish and some salt to taste. I'm gonna add my onions and give it a good stir. I'm not gonna put any water in quite yet. This is fresh chicken so I'm just gonna allow it to boil in its own juices for about half an hour. And I'm going to check it and add water should it need water. So this is the key ingredient that gives the soup the, its amazing flavour and aroma. So I am gonna prepare this. Let me show you how I do so it. So I'm not gonna use all of it. I'm just gonna use one of these ridges. So I'm just gonna cut this off. It's actually not as hard as it looks. So I'm only gonna use a piece like this. Mmm, God, this smells so good. This is what it looks like on the inside. So I've got my Uyayak piece and I'm just going to use a lighter just to burn the outside and what that does is it just releases the amazing aroma uh, into the soup. So burning quite well. Yeah, already I can start to smell it. It smells so good and this smell is going to linger in my kitchen for a few days. I just love the smell. Now I'm just gonna add it in with the kit uh, with the chicken and let it continue to cook. I'm gonna add a little bit of water. Now that the chicken is cooking nicely, I'm gonna add my um, smoked dried fish. I'm using barracuda. You can use anything you want. 
and I'm going to add a little bit of um, Cameroon pepper, not too much because my children will be eating. I love to add Cameroon pepper to most of my Nigerian dishes. I just love the flavour it gives. Give it a bit of a stir and add some more water. And I'm going to allow that to simmer down for about 10 minutes. And I'm going to check it at this point for salt. Yep, it's nicely salted. So my last ingredient is going to be the yam thickener. So this is just pounded yam. And I'm going to add pieces into the soup. And this is going to thicken up the soup. So I have put all of the pounded yam into the soup. I'm just going to let it dissolve and boil a little bit. And then we're going to be good to go. I'm so excited. Do you know how long I've waited for this soup? Oh my God. Oh my God. So all of the yam has dissolved and it's ready. Let me just taste it for salt. Make sure I've got enough salt. Mm, it's perfect. Wow. It smells so good and it tastes so good too. Mm. So guys, it's now time for me to dish up this delicious soup. Ooh. Can you see that? Wow. It just looks so amazing. And here we have it. Delicious, authentic, a five feather unen. Mmm. So guys, it's crunch time. Time to taste it. Wow, guys. This is delicious. This is absolutely delicious. Oh my God. Mmm. Wow. And the uyak. Mmm. You can't beat it. I've been waiting for this for such a long time. So I'm going to eat this off camera. And traditionally, this is eaten with pounder jam. Guys, if you like this video, make sure that you like, share, and subscribe. And all of that good stuff. Me, I'm going to go and enjoy my fire feather. See you in the next video.